I love lemon meringue pie and often wonder why in restaurant menus it's only listed as a dessert and not a main course. With Corel Draw 9, Corel gives us the control to customize our menus. It's all designed to help us save time and make the powerful Corel Draw 9 easier to use. To do this, click Tools, Options, Customize, and then Menus. On the left are all the commands Corel Draw 9 can perform divided into subcategories. On the right are the different menus included in Corel Draw 9. We'll work with the main menu which is always at the top of the screen. Many of the commands have an ampersand sign. This indicates that the letter following the sign is the letter you can use to navigate using the keyboard. For example, the file menu item can be opened in Corel Draw 9 by pressing Alt F, the letter right after the ampersand sign. If we click on a command in either window to highlight it, the details about the command appear here. First, select the command we wish to add to the menu. Then on the right, select the menu. Then, select the command just above the spot where the new command should appear. In this case, we want to place the cut command between new from template and open. So we click on new from template and then press the add button. And the cut command appears just after the highlighted command. If we wish to move our new command or to rearrange any of the commands in the menu, Highlight the command and use the up and down keys to shift them around. The remove button deletes the highlighted command from the menu list on the right. We can also add a separator line after the highlighted command in the menu list. This helps to keep similar commands grouped together. And another way to group subcommands and to save space is to create a submenu. We can see this in many programs where mousing over one command in a menu list will have another submenu appear to the side with more detailed options. File Acquire Image is an example in Corel Draw 9. Simply click Add Menu and then give the submenu a name. From here, feel free to add any commands from the left as desired. If at any time we wish to revert to the settings that we had before making any changes, just click Reset. All in all, it seems that Corel Draw 9's customizable menus are a recipe for success.